Hey, I'm Cody, and in this video today, I'm going to show you why you should be streamlining your podcast workflow using AI Podcast Show Notes. So first off, what is AI Podcast Show Notes? So AI Podcast Show Notes are show notes that are written by AI. So what this means is you upload a file into the tool, um, it then makes a transcript, and then from that transcript, it generates title of variations, summary variations, um, it does timestamp show notes, it does long form articles, basically anything you can imagine uh, that you would include in your podcast show notes, that's what it's writing for you. So why is this super valuable? It's, it, it, show notes are one of the most important things that you can do from an SEO perspective, um, but it, it's just extremely time consuming, right? I mean, just thinking through that process, like we're doing this week over week, there's hours of time <laughs> that are being invested in the show notes. And this is largely what a lot of agencies and bigger companies do, right? They just focus on this. So um, that's kind of the biggest thing that it, that it affects is that time-saving principle. It also just makes it a standardized process, right? So when you're using timestamps or, or when you're using uh, an AI written show notes, um, you know that the quality is going to be consistent every time. Um, you, there's no variability. You're not working with a, a freelancer who's good one day and bad the next. Um, so it just creates that consistency for, for your podcast. And it also just automates this. The, the, <laughs> we didn't get into podcasting because we wanted uh, to <laughs> write show notes. This is kind of one of those deleterious pieces. Um, and so that's why uh, it, it, AI podcast show notes um, are kind of the future of, of podcasting when it comes to show notes writing. So the core benefits of, of using these show notes generators is kind of what I just uh, talked about. So it's um, specifically looking at the ability for uh, show notes to be consistent, to be long form, um, and to be super detailed, right? Where it's including um, all of the different aspects um, of the podcast into your show notes uh, without you having to dig through, okay, what were the topics about? Pull out those sections, pull out those pieces from the transcript. So uh, the tool we're going to be looking at today is called Swell AI. So Swell AI uh, automates writing podcast show notes, articles, social posts, and more. Um, looking at this one because it's free to sign up um, and uh, also uh, just has basically all the features that you could want as a podcaster. Um, so uh, kind of to take a step forward, so here's how to use AI podcast show notes in the workflow that, that um, works best. So once you sign up for Swell, again, it's free. Uh, you can click the uh, or sign up with the form here. You'll be dropped into this dashboard. In this dashboard, you can uh, you have projects. So, what projects are is the ability uh, for you to manage multiple podcasts uh, in a single dashboard. So, this is super useful if you're like a, a contractor, or, you know, somebody that's working with multiple podcasts, or you're doing, you know, um, you, you're an agency, etc. So, this allows for you uh, to basically have that organization of, of show notes outputs for each of them. So what's super cool about Swell is you can have sources and destinations. This is like one of the reasons that I love it. Um, so sources, what it allows for uh, is the ability to connect all the places that your podcast could be published. So there's a first off, like, let me just talk through kind of how I use it in my workflow. So I make a podcast episode. I would then edit that episode. I do all the post-production audio work. And at that point, I would then take that file and I would upload it. So say I have this MP4, I want it uploaded in. Um, I upload it into Swell, and what Swell generates is this extremely detailed uh, podcast show notes for me. So um, you get the transcript, uh, you get a long form article written about that episode, um, you get uh, timestamps, you get summary options to pick from, you get titles. I mean, it's awesome and unbelievable that it does this, um, and it just speeds up again the workflow so much that it, it, it creates great like a ton of throughput, right? Um, so all of these can be combined uh, so that you can make these really detailed show notes. And it does that for all those episodes. So you can do multiple episodes at the same time. That's what's amazing. Um, and you can also pull from different sources. So you can import a YouTube video URL. You can import multiple episodes from your back catalog, from your RSS feed. Um, so say you wanted to write articles about all of your previously published episodes. You can do that super easily. Um, then uh, you can also connect your Apple podcast URL, do the exact th same thing. And Swell will actually show you which ones it is written about, uh, about previously. You'll, you can see that they're already imported, so you don't want to import those again. All right, so that's uh, the sources piece. Uh, or Sorry, that's a part of the sources. The other sources that you can do is add Google Drive folders and Dropbox folders. So if, say, your team works off of Google Drive or Dropbox, you can take an uh, edited episode, drop it into a Dropbox folder. It'll automatically be sent into Swell. And then you can actually set up destinations so that 
the uh, outputs go to another Dropbox folder or another Google Drive folder. Or say you use something like an Airtable that has an endpoint with a webhook, you can send it there as well. Another thing that's, I mean, I don't use this, but another thing that uh, you could use is the API integration. So the, for the API integrations, um, what it allows for um, is the ability to uh, build swell into your, your own apps and workflows. So um, uh, they have, you know, say you're a, you have a, a pre-built software that you use for all of your client management, you could build this right into swell. So it just fits right into your workflows. So um, that's really kind of the high level overview of how to use these AI tools. So when you're looking at choosing the right tool, some of the core things to think about are like, does it offer all of the writing that you're looking for? So I'd really focus on those integrations and the writing features. So you want something that writes show notes, articles, social posts, has time trans uh, timestamp transcripts, has podcast summaries, has titles. Ha can you do LinkedIn posts? Can you do Twitter threads? Can you do emails? So I'm going to talk about these three, and this is one of my favorite features with Swell. Um, so it, what uh, it allows for you to do is, so it's called Swell Chat, and you can basically have it write anything you want about the podcast episode. So let me do something like write a LinkedIn post with bullet points. I can also do something like write a 10 tweet Twitter thread or something like writes an email newsletter, make it detailed with all the topics covered and a call to action to listen. All right. So those are generating. I can look at that LinkedIn post. It has all those detailed bullet points. Um, I can look at the Twitter thread. It outputs all of those tweets for me. I mean, this is amazing, right? <laughs> um, and then that email newsletter is writing. So you can do that for all of the episodes. You can do as many of those as you want as well, which is uh, super awesome. Um, what I like with uh, this export feature is you can connect these destinations and send all of these to wherever you want. So again, you have that uh, subject line. You have um, you know, all of this. You have the call to action. You know, and basically, anything you could think of, you could have swell write. So that's kind of the core. Um, then I, so, you know, that's one of the things that I would look at. The other thing is in the integration. So how easily it connects with the workflow and the tools that I use already. That's something I would consider as well. But yeah, so that's uh, basically um, why you should be using, um, why you should be using uh, AI podcast show notes uh, for your, uh, like streamlining your podcast workflow. Um, what's great uh, with this is Swell AI is free to sign up and start using. So if you just go to swellai.com, you can start using that uh, and get started. Cheers.